years about, you know, doing something on the side, putting something together, and just, you know, just to have fun with it. And, to have to have something to do, and you guys wouldn't be fucking really. You're coming off the of Mudvayne tour, and you were gonna take a, a long time off, and we were like, "What are we gonna do about a drummer?" And you know, that's when you know, I was like, "Well, you know, fucking." This was back when you know we had the other dude in the band for a minute, you know. <laughs> but I had said I was like, you know, dude, you know, cool, fucking. Call Vinny up and see what he says. The worst he could say was no. And you did quite a few times, you know. Yeah, a few times, just because I, I didn't know if I was ready to do it. Yeah, yet. and you know, the story goes, you know, got you on a good night. Got me on a night, but I've been drinking some red wine and listening to a lot of Kiss. Yeah. And I was like, you know what? It sounded like a damn good idea. Let's take a shot at it and just see what happens. And you know what? It was, it was like that innocent. It wasn't like we had these big plans. Right, right. Called time I'm like, dude, I don't know this motherfucker. <laughs> I'm getting ready to get on a fucking airplane tomorrow and go write a record with this dude. I've talked to him for not even 15 fucking minutes on the phone. I'm gonna go to Dallas yeah. and live at his house and write a record. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Mike. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so we all walk oh, in and we're, and we're like, you know, looking around his house and all the plaques and we're all fucking hands. We have to Greg and I have never been there. We're like, you all know, the plaques. And probably stood there for like five or ten minutes and just like, Fuck is kind of thing. Like, is he here? And he comes walking out. He's like, "Hey, what's going on? Come on out back. Let me show you all that I built you." So we fucking walk out the back door, and on his pull back, man, he built these fucking this. It looked like a kind of like a the size of a trailer, like you know, like a rectangle, a rectangle structure with four fucking doors. And he walks over and opens the door. Each one of them has a color. Each one of them has a theme. There's a three three three, a six six six. The six 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 one's got big fucking devils in it and shit. That's what Greg did. Greg did devil room. <laughs> Tom got the looper room. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> mine's I can't remember. Mine was sixty nine. It was just fucking spackled with fucking porn. <laughs> like all over the walls. Shit. I'm like, oh, this. this and they were appropriately named. The bungalows. Yeah, yeah, the bungalows. Yeah. So, uh, I went and got a bottle of lotion. <laughs> <laughs> and a big thing of Kleenex. And, we and the rest is fucking history. Yeah, this is well, history. we fired up the grill and we sent some people out to get us a couple of cases of beer. We should get a bunch of shots and just started shooting the shit. And I mean, I just felt right at home with these dudes. I mean, it's just like. There's a lot of anxiety let's, there. Let, let's give it a shot, first, man. You know, because uh, we got on good. The first jam did, was a lot of anxiety. Oh, the first jam did was scary, dude. Jesus yeah. Christ. I hadn't really played the drums since all that happened. And uh, we went down to my brother's house to the studio. And I hadn't been in there in ages. And Sterling comes in with us. And I mean, I'm sweating. I had not got behind the drum. And I'm freaking out. It's like, wow, I don't know if I can do this or not. We fucking sat down. We started playing. And the first thing we did was nausea. And trust me, I felt like puking all over the place. <laughs> I mean, it was a heavy experience, man. Uh, but we made it through it, man, and, and it was just like fucking, this is fucking badass. And I think the next day we went back and wrote like two songs that day, and it was just, it just kept rolling. It just kept time, pouring exactly. out of us, man, and it was just, all right, that's this magic. It was so chemistry, you know, we had some chemistry. The next day, dude. <laughs> <laughs> we were hungover every day on every record we've ever made. I just remember, I didn't want to see a beer, I didn't want to see anything. Well, just come in. Hey, well, check this out. Dude, you, really you may have been fucking hungover, but you've like started going into the riff for fucking matter yeah. of time. And fucking Vince kicks into the and we're almost going into it, and then you get up. Where's the beer? <laughs> right the fucking way. <laughs>